to Denver International Airport's virtual tour series. I'm your host, Alex Renteria. And today, we're gonna get a look at what's behind me, the train to the gate. That's the underground train system. And as many of you know, you can walk to Concourse A via the pedestrian bridge. But otherwise, we have to take the train and we're about to learn all about it. The train operation is really technical, which is why we have Matthew Smith, Denver International Airport's train program administrator here with us today. Thank you so much for joining us. It's my pleasure, Alex. Let's begin by checking out where the train operates. Let's do it. Alex, our train operates beneath the airport and airfield in two tunnels. Each is over one mile long. The train travels about 130 round trips every day, going over 160 miles. Wow, that is a lot of trips. Now, does each train take the same route? Great question and not exactly. We have seven four-car trains that travel between the terminal and concourses. When it reaches concourse C, the train reverses directions. That is amazing because it goes on one continuous loop underneath the airport. So how do the trains know where to go? Uh, that's a great question. Let's go check out our control center. Come on. We're outside central control. The trains are controlled by several computer systems, and at the platforms, passengers board and exit the train through automatically operated doors. On average, a train arrives every two to three minutes, and it takes five minutes to travel from the main terminal to Concourse C. And there isn't a conductor on these trains? No, we don't have a conductor on board. A system controls the movement of the train from this facility at Den. Here, train operators monitor the train's movements and respond to any problems. Technicians inspect each car, deep clean the cars, and perform necessary maintenance to keep them in good condition. We also conduct regular preventative maintenance on the entire system. Wow, a lot goes into keeping these trains in tip-top shape, including cleaning and disinfecting each car amid COVID. How many cars do run underneath the airport? We own 31 vehicles, 16 of which have been with us since we opened in 1995. Those 16 have traveled over 22 million miles. I imagine there's plans to reinvest in more trains. Absolutely. We have 26 brand new vehicles coming our way. The first 16 will retire, but the fleet will grow to 41 to keep pace with our airport's continued growth. My personal favorite part of the train are the voices of the train. Nine News anchor Kim Christensen and Denver Sports announcer Alan Roach. What can you tell us about that? Alex, we call that the train call. And the voice of the train has become a fixture of our airport. Alan and Kim were selected in 2018 following an online poll of over 75,000 of our passengers. That's incredible. Thank you so much for taking on this tour, Matthew. And thank you for joining us behind the scenes on the train to the gates. For more information, visit flydenver.com and we'll see you next time.